Well, let's go talk to, uh, 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 you know, I don't know. Where do we go? I'm gonna go talk to Aveline. Hopefully that'll be a little bit more fruitful. I, I want to bring Anders, but I don't, because every time, almost every time he opens his mouth, I want to punch him. But I do need to bring Isabella. Uh... I just really want to punch you, apparently. I just really want a good reason to punch you. Coming back tomorrow? To see who? There's nobody to see. Aveline, there's trouble. You have no Viscount. It's clear you're suffering without uh, sufficient leadership. No. That doesn't grant default authority to you or your commander. I'll beat up anybody who it tries. It would be easier if you cooperate. No, I will stab you in the face. Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? Guard, Captain. No name, Templar. Oh. Trouble. Eh? Yes. He's been hounding me. These Templars strut around as it is, but now it's just... out of hand. Knight Captain Cullen has heard some troubling things. Such as? That you coddle the men. Give special treatment. Someone has dared. Who? Who accuses me of this? No names given, of course. No wonder the Lieutenant was harassing me. Bastards. If they think I'm coddling anyone, it'll be my husband, Donnick. You and I will intercept his patrol tonight. Then you can see for yourself if I'm coddling him, or any in my command. Well, I could do with a breath of fresh air. Good, because there's no way I would let this go. Nope. Cullum wants to know if these things are true. You'll be able to tell him. Donnick's patrol, Hawk. Me and you, tonight. Okay. I really hope we don't lose Donick. Accuse me of being soft. Not in this lifetime. Okay. Oh, that guy was creepy. That was creepy for a second. <sighs> and boop. Oh, well. Okay. Oh, boy. Time to get going. That's the Keeper's voice. That's kind of creepy. Oh, my headphones are driving me kind of crazy right now. Okay. Aveline. Oh, wait. Remove. Aveline will bring Anders and Isabella. Yes. Okay, let's level you guys up. Hmm. Oh, wait, let's put one into... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um. What's that one? Right, that one did look really cool. Hi, Evelyn. It's been a while. I'm very sorry. Uh, I haven't given her like any dexterity at all. Well, I don't like that one. What? No, that's like horrible. I did have her... Let's see, wait, was there... Okay, let's get... Okay. Inventory really quick. 
Oops. Arvor's prize. You're not good. The whaler. It's not very good. Nope. Nope. Okay, um. Hmm. Mage's friend. But the shield she's got on is really, really cool. Like, look at that electricity resistance and immunity to stun and knockback. Like, wow. So, there's that to take into account. Ward wall. That's really cool. You should be good. All right, let's go. We're going... Where's Donix patrol? Favor and fault? Is that what it was? Yeah. Okay. Oh, if we lose Donic, that's gonna be no good. That's gonna be no good. No good, no good, no good. All right. We took out the guys that were here, so that's nice. Let's see how hard you sweat your men. What, what, what? Guardsman Donic! We are... I, I actually don't think this is a good idea. Because it's showing that we're coddling, I think. I don't know why she thinks this is a good idea. To show that she's not coddling. Oh, hey. Oh, no, okay. Got a little something for you. Why is it not working? I can't see Gidney. Sir Ahawk, or is it always champion now? You're too much of a chameleon, my friend. <laughs> I didn't expect to find you so deep in bandits. A good day, to be sure. I'll be sore tomorrow, but it was my choice. Tell me what's going on. It's all right. Go ahead. Every guard chooses the patrol they want. My wife promotes from the bold, not the reckless. Action is up. Casualties are down. It is... remarkable. As are you, love. Oh! Oh my gosh! Thank you. That will do. Another time, Sir Arhawk. Safe travels. Okay. That should be sufficient. Take that to the Templar. Okay. Indeed. Let's go talk to Cullen. <laughs> <laughs> All right, off to talk to Cullen then. Doodly doodly doodly. He had somebody with him though. At least there's that. Like, you know, like, it wasn't just, like, last time where he was all by his lonesome. Oh, my brain hurts, but I just want to finish this game! Call him, buddy old pal. So, Donick was in the rose. He was not. Easy, big girl. He wasn't shopping for himself. You're lucky to have a man who wants to please you. What? But maybe you could indulge him more. Are there areas of intimacy you haven't explored? Why? Uh -huh. Why do you give me these doubts? <laughs> Aveline, if you shove your thumb up his ass, I win. Just... <laughs> no. <laughs> Like, ah! 
there are some places you just don't go. Uh. <laughs> Champion, and you are with the captain. None too happy about the accusations against her, I'm sure. You could say that. Uh. Yeah, I don't know. I have successfully wasted my time, Ooh. and there is no merit to the claims. Ooh, nice. As I suspected. <laughs> Then why press Cullen's this? like, please just chill out. Some feel that the solution to the current crisis of leadership is to consolidate authority. So Meredith wants a Templar. As long as these complaints continue, baseless or not, they will serve as justification for eliminating the position of guard captain. It would be the simplest fix, whether or not I agree. Just point me in the right direction, and I'll get you some peace and quiet. There you go. I have no answers for you other than to say that all of the complaints have come from Lowtown. Guardsman Brennan is on that patrol. Why wouldn't she oh, tell me this? Oh, Brennan, she was having issues I don't know. way back. I do apologize for the assumptions of this incident, Guard Captain. It has been unfortunate. It's not done. Woo! To Lowtown Hawk. I need to speak to Brennan. Okay. Yes, ma'am. I don't know how we would have stopped Huon and Evelina. Oh, I'm pretty sure you could have handled it. Wait. What's the... Oh, I gotta go talk right. No, not yet. To Lowtown at night, then? She was always jealous. Or not always. Well, freaking, we saved her life with the bag incident in Act 1. And then, and then when Donick started getting all cuddly with Aveline, she got super jealous for some reason. No, they're not talking. Oh, come on. I just want to talk. To Brennan and see why she's gotten all brain dead. Oh, my gosh, it's a big squad. Yeah, no, I don't care. Whoa, wait, where? Over here? Hello, Brennan. Guardsman. Why did a Templar have to tell me there is unrest in this district? What's going on? Better make it good. It's Captain Jevon. I didn't report his return because I'm ashamed for him. He's trying to rile the guards against you, but none of us will follow him. You lead better than he ever did. We've made so many enemies. I don't remember him as that impressive. He deserves to be forgotten. He abused his position and blamed me when we caught him. He was well liked by some, but not once the truth was known. Well, let's go have a chat with the man. And my sword! The guards will have nothing to do with him. So he found others. Militia. Mostly anti Ferelden. Oh. The same kind who were against the Canari. I guess it's been long enough they've forgotten how many the champion killed. A rally. Against the tyranny of the guard and foreigners who infest Kirkwall. I'm sorry, Captain. You better be telling the truth, girly. Return to the barracks. The rally is in Darktown, Hawk. I need to be there. Aye, aye, ma'am. And that is where we shall go. Dark town. Avalines are always very long, very 
complicated. I really should give myself a break. I don't think I'm gonna finish this tonight, but I just, I just wanna be done. I wanna just see how it all plays out. I just, I don't wanna leave it hanging before I go uh, out to work again. Hey, buddies. Oh, is it down in the sewers? Going to have to do some shopping oh. upstairs pretty Wait, soon. Wait, nope, nope. It's uh down here. The champion here. Also, the, the guard captain. captain. Are we ready for this? Are you stupid? Too long, brave Kirkwall. You did not throw off all others only to fall under Ferelden influence. Leaderless, displaced. Alien hands on the most basic authority. Foreign elite bleeding you. Oh, such Jevin. triggering. Such triggering words. You disgrace yourself. The Ferelden with the Elysian name. Yeah. Is there anyone so? else who so embodies how far this city has fallen? This one is all yours, Captain. Do they know how you sacrificed your men? How you alone disgraced your name? Bitch! You took everything from me! Yeah, that's a solid argument. You took it from yourself. The guard know this, and none stand with you. He stands alone. This is no rebellion. It is delusion. A joke inflicted on Kirkwall, your home and mine. I will not be left with nothing again. No. You shall have less. So we're taking the law into our own hand then, Adeline? Oh, he had the thing. But that was an insurgent. Where did he go? Where'd the guy go? Oh, he's up there. Yeah? Ow, oh, something hit me. Oh, there he is. Uh, what did you do? Um, come back here. Oh. Ow, he did the thing. Where is he? Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, that's a mercenary. <laughs> Isabella is so scary. <laughs> These guys are still fighting us? Like, really? You fool. Why would you do this? If I live to a hundred, I will never understand his kind. To the barracks, Hawk. My guardsmen will be waiting. Hmm. Whoa. Ah! Oh, shoot. We can't... Oh, that's like... Whoa. That's like... That's like Aveline's armor, but... Like, the last armor piece. We are done. 
to the guardsmen now to explain the situation? I don't know. Maybe we'll have to tell Cullen that, you know, everything's fine. Chill out. Oh, wait. Let's, um, where's... Yeah. About knowing who you are. I'm the captain of the guard. I'm loyal, strong, and I don't look too bad naked. <laughs> exactly. And if I called you a mannish, awkward, oh. ball-crushing do-gooder, you'd say... Shut up, whore. Yep. That's my girl. <laughs> Yay! They're such good friends! <sighs> so, Aveline... Aveline's got the confidence now. That's what she was... That's what... That's what, uh... That's what Isabella was saying forever ago. Knowing yourself is confidence, so. I certainly hope Orsino and Meredith aren't like, here, let's have three quests each to give you. And then I'll just be like, like hopefully Orsino's is like maybe three parts to it like Meredith's was. And all I have to do is, well, I was done. With, I'm done with Meredith now. I finished it. Um, Come to my solstice dinner party. Look at you. Dinner parties, <sighs> cooking. Do you have a lace apron yet, or should I get one for you? Don't change the subject. I sent you an invitation, and you didn't show up. I thought it would be... I mean, I don't know. Aww. I just don't do family gatherings. Besides, one day you and Donick will have children, and I'll be the last person you want around. Auntie them. Isabella. Imagine all the awkward questions you have to answer. <laughs> Mother, what's a slattern? Oh boy! I'll just point at you and say that's a slattern. <laughs> exactly. Um. Well, uh, didn't we have to come here and talk to Avalie? Okay. Come along. Come along, Emmeline. Let's chat. Jevon, son of a bitch. You build a good thing, work your hardest, and the past just claws at you. Doesn't it, though? Tell me about it. I can't go 20 minutes without getting jumped. Yeah. But when does it start to hurt those you care about? Mm. I've tried to lead well, but this... I wonder what I would do if my captain lost my respect. Captain, we're waiting for orders. Will you accept them? May I speak freely? There isn't a man or woman here who wouldn't follow you through the void. Captain. You're good, Aveline. I'll take it. You're not perfect. I need a moment, Hawk, but... There is something else. Come back and talk to me. Yeah, that's what you said earlier. Questioning beliefs. <laughs> what? And then he says, he says, I swear I had two when I came in here. Uh-oh. <laughs> you know, those stains never came out. You are horrible. Every inch. <laughs> you love it, big girl. And you owe me for the bottle. <laughs> Hawk. <laughs> Hawk. She's not so bad. Except when she is. Yeah. Did you know I've been dead for seven years? What? I got word last week. They only just sorted the casualties of Ostagar. Whoa. The king has offered to reinstate the commission of any surviving officers who will return to Ferelden. Ah. There is no king. And? There is no king. And what? There's no king! It's only, um... Anora! Oh, Because ah, Alistair is like... He's a Grey Warden! Uh-oh. Does this appeal matter? I thought you were sworn to Caelan. Regardless of who has the throne, I served Ferelden. The country survives, even if Caelan didn't. Um... You brought it up. What's your decision? It's been a strange time here in Kirkwall. You love it here! Do you ever think about that last night at Ostagar? How it happened? I don't mean the betrayal. Everyone knows the signal went up and the flanking charge never came. 
But that moment when the tower lit and then... The fight just kept going. It was the oddest feeling. Hope answered with... Nothing. I don't like the thought of going out with a whimper, Hawk. Nah. Not again. Shock of shocks. You're staying. You'd walk all over a new captain. I could never subject these men to that. <coughs> Thank you for everything. I have so much because of you. I'm here for you, Hawk. And for myself. Good. She's balanced her life out. That's good. I'm glad. Nothing going on, Hawk. You'd be the first to know if there was. All right. I am glad you are good. I am glad. Okay, we should probably go talk to Orsino, um, but I probably will call this part here. Um, and then I'm ignoring, I'm ignoring these. <laughs> and I'm going to do best served cold next. So, thank you guys for joining me. Hope, hope you're liking it. <laughs> I will see you in the next one.